Can't believe it. Oh, hi everybody. <laughs> I just squirted perfume before I came on to do a video and the ice cream man has just joined us. Um, yeah, sorry. Hi everyone. I thought it was about time I did a video of this year because I think last year I did my first video in June. But I've been sort of staying off YouTube because it, you know what it's like sometimes. The old YouTubes. So, yeah, I was wanting to do this video earlier. Ignore that side. <laughs> I was wanting to do this video earlier, but it was a beautiful drying day, so I did two lots of washing. Went for lunch at my sister's, and I'm gonna show you what we've done this year. We wanted to try and make use of the space that we've got, because we've got a really dinky garden. Um, so we've sort of elevated everything this year and done some vertical gardening. So I shall start over here. What we did was, um, this is our salad trays, which have been amazing. Um, they're just starting to grow again, actually. They love water, they don't like too much sun. Um, so if you've got salad, anything with salad, just try and keep it out of the sun. Like too much sun, too hot sun. Now, we made a bit of a mistake this year. So this basil here, I've just chopped the top off. The same as this one and this one. What happened this year was we took some tips. Um, because we've got a no-dig garden, we took some tips about how to help, you know, grow things. And unfortunately, it was to do with bark and using bark to put underneath. So, um, I'll just move that away. So this basil here has got bark underneath and soil. And unfortunately, the bark is treated, and we didn't know that at the time, we thought it was organic. So, these nasturtiums here also have a huge amount of bark below the soil. So that's, that's what I want to show you, how badly it affected the leaves. I mean, we have nasturtiums for butterflies, like they love it, and to keep them away from our other stuff that's growing. I mean, they've survived and they've produced their first flower. I'm just gonna have a little look, yeah. So that's okay, they've survived it. They're, they're a really strong plant and nasturtiums are amazing. They're peppery, you can put them in salads and soups. They're beautiful. So yeah, so we've got some coriander here. We made our own little pond down here because we've got a family of frogs that we um, have had for years. So we've left a little space. These little gaps are for the frogs to get in and out. Um, now, this lawn that we've got here, you know, I don't know if you can, I can't see properly, sorry. So yeah, this lawn took us ages to grow. I'm just gonna go back a bit so you can see. So last year, I think you might remember, I showed you the difficulty we had with this weeping willow tree. Um, and the roots would go for miles underneath, um, which was affecting our growing ability. 